This week on What's Up, we shine the spotlight on Dashiki, a traditional attire which has become a favorite of many young people. The Dashiki is a free-flowing garment native to West Africa, with its design and look varying from one tribe to another. Rich in prints and sometimes made with locally produced textiles, it may come in form of a loosely fitted garment for the upper body, paired with a matching trouser if the wearer pleases. In recent times, it has been embraced by fashion lovers as a great way to step out in style and make a statement, making it an ideal choice for a dress code at gatherings like this. A lot of our young people do not know where you are coming from. Um, mind you, we have different kinds of dashiki. You have the, um, the Ghanaian dashiki, you have the Nigerian dashiki. So, but what informed us using the dashiki is for us to um, use something that, that is closer to the people. And we saw that um, it's more like a trend for um, young people to wear the dashiki these days. You can see stars like Two Face, um, a nice P Square, going for events and um, dressing in dashiki attire. So you can see that it has more appealing amongst young people today. Dashiki may have originated as a traditional outfit but it has become a favorite among young people. Dashiki is a very unique attire. It, um, it tends to bring out the best, actually from the part of the tailors, uh, before we who are wearing the um, Dashiki attire itself. It gives you a unique, a unique sense of um, fashion, uh, it, combining traditional, um, the traditional Agbada style with the modern and um, contemporary slim fit um, kind of thing. So Dashiki, Dashiki gives you kind of a mix for those of people that wouldn't want to wear the very big agbada, but still want to have a touch of, um, of tradition. So the dashiki bridges that gap between the old and the new. Dashiki as an outfit um, is a very comfortable dress that makes people appear very nice and uh, you know look good. It's not explosive, it's very comfortable and cool on the body. I like dashiki because it's comfortable. Like you see, you can wear it on anything. Like now I'm the queen. Uh, I have a canvas in my bag, so during the dance I can wear it with it. I can wear it with heels, I can wear it with canvas, anything. It's just comfortable. It's free, it's good school. My thoughts about Danshiki, um, I think it's a very great outfit. I really like the style because it comes with different varieties. We have some people that can wear it with long trousers, a short wrapper and a short as well. It's a very great style, I like wearing it. Danshiki comes in various styles and colors. This makes it adaptable to one's personal choice for the purpose of comfort and self-expression. Simply put, with Dashiki, everyone can make a statement. I chose this particular one, this Dazinesi one, uh, because I'm the queen. I'm, I'm the queen for my parish. So that's why I chose this one. It's comfortable for me. I love style and um, you dress the way you want to be addressed. I like to do something different. So that's how I had to start my Danshiki in this way, to do something different, you know, just to add to something to make my Danshiki look um, unique from every other person here. Well, I like mature colors, so cream and black is a mature color. The reason why I chose to wear white is because I love white. White is one of my favorites. I, I have two favorite colors, which is white and purple, so when I'm not wearing purple for an event, I wear white. So white is a very, color, a very great color because it stands for purity. So it stands, I really love it a lot. It's my type that I love putting on color combinations, understand? understand? I, I love, it's just my life, I love, I love mix, mixed up, understand? And as a king of Omole, Sion, so I, I got to look different. This Danshiki I'm putting on is my birthday gift, the material. So I just wanted to put it on today to remember who bought it for me. It's actually a special gift from a special friend. So I decided to put it on today and look unique and different. Clothing goes hand in hand with accessories, face caps, jewelry, footwear can make or mar an outfit. The youths here took this into consideration before pairing their outfits with the accessories they had on. This represents me as an Igbo man. I'm a uh, This for the sun, understand? I'm the type that puts on sun glasses, sun shades. The cheeky, the black. I love black so much. Mixed with um, a kind of yellow. So I just, I love the, uh, my, my dress code. I just felt 
that um, this shoe matches. Um, it has a touch of black and brown. So and I love both colors. And um, since I have, um, I don't have one that has um, black and gold. So the closest to it is it's just this. I like to look like a dancer. You know, I'm very rugged. I'm not this cool and gentle type. You know, I like to be free. You know, very very hard as a youth that I am. Basically, Danshiki doesn't need so much accessories per se. That's why you can see I'm not wearing a chain. I went for a dangly earring, so I don't need a chain. Um, my my crown is silver, so I just did. I can do black shoes. My my research is also silver, so you don't really need much accessories. It's already bright on its own. The design, the, the creativity on it is okay. Basically, because I'm putting on white, so I think whatever anything that can goes with white that would make it look so perfect is black. So I really don't want to go out of the white and black stuff. That's why I wear a silver earring, a silver shoe with a black bracelet and black wristwatch. Dashiki may appeal to people for various reasons, but for these ones, the love for Dashiki is worth the querying. My name is Evil Grace, aka Gpel, and I rep Dashiki. My name is Okul Emmanuel. I love Dashiki, African culture. Rep. My name is Priscilla Simon. I love Danshiki. My name is Judith Chinaya Uwanko. I love Danshiki so much. It's a very great style. My name is Okechuku Mary, Mary May. I love Danshiki. My name is Patrick Alasha and I rep Danshiki all the way.